Hey guys, how are you doing today? I got a delightful little surprise. I like to, I got Happy Mail. I also like to call them delightful deliveries because I like, you know, D's. No, I like um, alliteration, that's the word. So my friend Robin sent me a nice little uh, uh, package. And this is just says some gifts for you, love Robin. And we have this cute little, whoops, there's a little kitty on the front. Sorry, I didn't clean all the paint off the last time. Because uh, I was video chatting with my friend. Otherwise, I would have made this already. But this is really cute. It's got a little stamp of a kitty. And then it's got little th uh, trims and, and whatnot. Some cute little on there. I thought that was really cute. And I think she explained some stuff about the journal. But once I saw there was a journal, I was like, oh, I gotta wait. I gotta do record this. So I had to wait till my friend had to, till she was done talking, <laughs> which is fine. All right, so I got a glassing bag. See, I count everything. And then there's these little, um, well, kind of like books, I think, like Bookman, Harper's Bazaar, just little, little things that you could use in layering bits, or I could even, uh, Put the glaze on them and make them into charms. Oh, there's some more. Children's Book Week. So those are cute. And, oh, I love these envelopes. I might use that as a template, too. I like the way... I like the size of it, too. And, oh, it's a postcard. Like a little color postcard. That's really cute. And this looks like vintage friendship. Is a chain of tried steel cast to link the present with the past on that pretty so that is from i don't know 9 12 which i think is just september 12th can't always see the year but obviously vintage old stamp on there and everything that's really nice thank you robin and a journaling card which is really pretty and great for spring and i told my husband i was recording but oh this is like a compact disc size the thicker that's cool and this looks like an envelope that she dyed which is really cool and here's some ephemera that she made i believe <laughs> and a medallion i don't know where she gets those so this is a medallion, one of my medallions on there. I love to see, I love to, don't you like to see stuff that you made, used? Oh, oh, it got sent back to me. <laughs> oh, cute. And then I get to see how she decorates some of the things I've sent to her too, which is fun. That's really cute with the rocking horse. This is a cute little folio. Oh, I think this opens up. I do that too. I'll fold up a piece of paper so you have extra journaling space. And the pretty lady. So that's a nice end place to write back there. That's really pretty. Oops, I don't mean to just throw it. That's what I do. So I had to do with everything and the boys. And I was trying to think. I think there's some painty paper behind there. Maybe some alcohol inks, but definitely some paint going on back there. So love that. She's doing some mixed media. Ah, squirrel. Once upon a time. I love the squirrel. So that's really cute. Collage the back on that one too. And some more collage on that one. <laughs> this is me. I'm the queen. I'm the only girl in the house. Well, no, the cat's right. The cat's the queen. We're, we're who's kidding who. That's really cute, Robin. Oh, I like that too. There we go. Using the die cut. I need to make some more die cuts. That die cut came out really good. Whoever... Is that one of the dies you have? That's really cute. These are all really cute. They're really nice. Oh, a little butterfly stamp going up into the... So, a CD thing, which she dyed and stamped, which looks really nice. With the journaling card inside. Part of me wants to cut that out and put it on something else, because that's what I do. And then another... Oh, an envelope. See, I love the feel of an envelope that's like this is collaged and sewn and kind of like a double paper kind of a thing. I don't know. I just like the feel of these. So I'm never, never upset to get envelopes. And then this envelope is dyed, which is really cool. I might have to 
mail her next purchase back in that. And then she made me a sewing journal, which is so sweet. So I get some fabric too, bonus. Oh, see, now I have, I have got to have a whole collection of journals with sewing pat, with sewing patterns as the cover. Because the one that I won from Jamie Parody also was one that used the sewing cover. All right, this is cool. I like that. That's really cool. So this is really cute fabric with the sewing machines. And then this has a little ruler that just tucks inside the closure. All right, I'm going to go back down here again to look at this. Let me see, can I? zoom in a little bit I, I was gonna zoom in after I recorded and then I ended up doing all the stuff up in the camera so all right so this is really cute she told me she was doing a sewing journal so I sent her some stuff and didn't know the sewing journal was supposed to be for me I don't know if she even knew it though so get a little sewing kit in there that's really cute and then there's a page from a uh, sewing book. And pretty flower here. And she made the from the padded hearts, turned it into a little tuck. I like this paper with the buttons too. So that's cute. Got a little texture going on there with the uh, st string, the thread. Thread, that's what it's called. Oh, this is a cute, look at this. She used the zipper to make a little top tuck. You could do a bottom tuck, belly band, all the things. This is pretty. This is really nice, Robin. And then a little piece of music paper, which you could either write around here, or I could use it in some collage, or you know, glue it onto a page in here. A little fabric flip. Look at the little safety pins. That's cute. Did you... Oh, this has got uh, stitching on it. Well, that's a good idea. And then the fabric that has the sewing notions on it snowflakes and stitches shop hop that's a good that's a good one to put into a sewing journal oh she's got a nice stamp too of a sewing machine some nice vintage pages in here and a little <coughs> excuse me added decoration and a dyed uh graph paper i love graph paper i don't know why we've got some hook and eyes uh some vintage hook and eyes and use it as a little tuck spot. So that's blank on the back and journal on the back there. And this pretty scissors. I have a die cut scissors like that, but I don't have a stamp. That's cool. Oh, and this, oh, this is really pretty. Did you see this? Isn't that pretty? Well, and she's wearing teal. Love it. I love her dress. I want I want to look that good in a dress like that. And then the little fabric flip, which is really cute. Little thing there, some stenciling. Little edging thing there. I like to look at other people's journals too for ideas. Oh my goodness. Alright, so this must be like a um puffy sticker, scissors. That's cool. Little thimble. Another little baby fabric flip. A little quil quilting square. Hey, you got gears in a sewing machine, it makes sense. These are nice dyed papers too. Oh, this is fun. That page there. Got a little thimble. We'll say this is a envelope in half, so you have a pocket on each side. And we have a sewing kit in here with a little emery board. And this cute little picture here. Oh, this is pretty trim right here. Little decorations here and here. The pretty little flowers. Ooh. Oh, that, yeah, sometimes the padded heart company, they'll add you, like, little extras in there that aren't the hearts, and those those are always nice, too, which I think that's what that is, because it, 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 it looks and feels like one of hers. And then we've got some texture on here, and some collaging, and this is cool. It's got patterns and stuff all over it. Oh, sewing machine. <coughs> Excuse me. I don't know. My throat's being extra weird today. A little bit of a uh, crocheting happened there. <coughs> ah, standard washing instructions for wool knit articles. That's cute. This is really nice, Robin. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And I just, you thinking of me is just special. Oh, wait, here's another one here. Oh, scissors. Look at those. They're so cute. I'm trying to 
kind of, oh, okay, this has a little thing on the back. Because I guess it could be a button. But it works really good for a charm, too. Those are really good. Another little mini fabric book, a little scrap piece. And a little decoration there. Just a little something to get you started on the page so you're not looking at a blank page, which is nice. And the little, that's cute. It's a little stamp piece with some of the vintage bits on that page and that pretty sewing machine right in there and I believe that's oh it's a postcard I thought it was one of Tim Holtz's things but he doesn't usually have anything on the back it's a, a mo card it's got some uh, Japanese or something down there spool of thread that's cute and the stenciling and that page is pretty there's some little Tim Holtz fabric there on the side a little sewing happening here. Some of the embroidery that up top. Top tuck. Sewing machine. The only perfect sewing machine for family use. So I haven't looked at these yet. I mean, I saw what they were and I was like, oh, I gotta do this on video so she can see my reactions. Hopefully, hopefully they're good. That's cool. She's the packaging for the foot. Of the sewing machine. Oh, there's the more of the puffy sticker. It's so cool. And from a vintage book, really cool. I think that's the um. Oh, I like that too. Some, you can you can kind of tell Tim Holt stuff sometimes, huh? It's really great pages in here and fun stuff. She's got some fun stamps too. So, how sewing machine. This is cute to do it on a a um. You know, it looks like a thing. You know what I'm trying to say, right? And then the package from the zipper. And another tuck spot here for the lady. And then sewing machine. And this little picture there. And then we got lots of texture going on here with a nice big journaling card and little strips, which I could write on or I could use as edging. This is a cute way to do, you know, when you're these are, look like they're all from the pages in the book. So they coordinate and uh, they're just really cute. And then a piece of uh, tape there. That's really cute, Robin. I really like it. Thank you so much. That was so sweet of you. It was such a nice surprise to get this in the mail today. And um, yeah, thank you so much, sweetie. I really like it. And I hope you and everyone else has a delightful day. And I hope you guys find good friends like I have. <laughs> Bye, guys. Love you.